كل ساحر وساحرة اللهم دمر السحرة ومن شايعهم ومن الحمد لله الولي المتقين حق من عبد واكرم من سئل والصلاه والسلام على اشرف الانبياء سراجا مرينا اما بعد احب في الله الحمد لله الله has given me this ability to inform the people of the dangers which are outside there's so many dangers and there's so many platform people can easily get to you uh, we ask Allah to protect us from these evil people with some behave very innocently but in fact they are not innocent innocent inside them there's a wolf ready to attack we ask allah to protect from those who we don't know that they will come eventually to cause harm today i'm going to discuss with you about the black magic of blood asihruddam this is very common magic very very common you will find it sprinkled in the door in the house in the toilet in the back garden everywhere you'll find it like that sometimes you'll find it placed inside a bottle somewhere recently a brother contacted me and he said brother i need to speak to you i told him regarding what he says it's very important just call me back please i've called him back when i call him back he said brother I found blood in my closet. How do I dispose it? I told him come to me and then inshallah I will dispose it for you by the will of Allah Rabbul Izza. And it didn't take long he came and visited me. He found this inside his closet. And in it there is a blood bottle of blood. Bismillah. sihr in allah sayyibatu you can see this bottle of blood i ask him how did it get there he said my house there was movement inside my house and there was one man who said he's going to help me to cleanse the house and he's told them to leave the house and they left the house they stayed outside he went in and he went around and left and told him everything is okay every spirit that was in the house i've cleansed it after some time he ended up finding this bottle inside his closet bottle full of blood is not his blood is not his family blood it's a blood which is in there and allah knows best what type of blood it is it could be menses blood it could be any another blood out there animal blood who oh, allah knows best the magic of blood is basically majority of the time is black magic of revenge or obedience the magic of blood is a one of the most serious black magic it could be a drop of blood done on the spell and majority of the time is black magic of menstruation they use it and they harm the individual very very bad the black magic of menstruation menstruation is itself is a toxic is poisonous that's why the devil goes for that the black magic of blood is dangerous it's very dangerous some go to a length and put it in the food the blood of menstruing or the blood whatever which is already been done magic on it and it will it affect the individual so badly and allah knows best it can disrupt it can separate spouses it can disrupt marriage it can bring it can make two individual who love each other so much hate each other so much it can prevent by the will of allah pregnancy they use it a lot it can either be sprinkled like i said in the beginning or just be left somewhere like this small bottle no one would ever think no one would ever think in their conscious mind that somebody can just come and place a bottle of blood like that we ask allah to protect us from these evil people 
when a person has been hit by the black magic of blood, we all know that Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam says the shaitan flows in the blood of son of Adam. It will make it very, very difficult for that individual when he is hit by the black magic of blood. The shaitan will be craving for blood. The one who came there because he came through blood. You will find sisters if they have been hit by the black magic of blood difficult to have cycle monthly cycle some of them you'll find they just bleeding and bleeding and bleeding and bleeding and allah knows best so this could either be the black magic of sihrudam black magic of blood or it could be other sickness because the 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 the, the, the the magic symptoms and the gene possession, they always go hand in hand. Some look similarity to the other. What are the symptoms of this magic? But in general, there's always three symptoms where I always like to mention. Ibadah, the person will struggle. Sleeping, the person will struggle. Livelihood, the person will struggle. In any magic the symptoms of black magic of blood when it's drunk or eaten or sprinkled in the house. So I'm combining three into one. When it's drunk, eaten or sprinkled in the house or be left in the bottle or Allah knows best, whatever method but black magic of blood. I'm combining Four, let's say four, eaten, black magic of eaten, drunk, sprinkle in the house or left in the bottle, in whatever state. This brings problem, so much problem. If it was associated with eating, the black magic was placed, the, the, the blood was put in the, in the food. For example, rice or meat or whatever type of meat. Wallahi, thumma wallahi, the person will find it so difficult in his life. The person will start feeling lower back, so much pain that he cannot control. If he was meant to separate husband and wife, he, the husband or the wife, will hate the husband so much or will hate the wife so much crying when the enchant or the person who's go hit by the magic when he hears quran he will burst into tears and not small tears very loud tears crying feeling movement in the stomach if he was at or drunk feeling movement, feeling sensation of vomiting and the sensation of vomiting, you feel like there's blood you want to vomit or you feel the taste of blood. Difficult breathing, especially when sleeping, nightmares, feeling nervous and angry always, feeling sleepy and increased desire to sleep for a long period of time, feeling psychological discomfort such as mood swings and anxiety, insomnia and stress, disorder that causes heavy bleeding in menstrual. I think I've mentioned before, which this one, you can either say other sihr does the same as well. For example, Sihr al wa al Injab. This happens as well. You'll find the person bleeding. Or Sihr al Nazif does as well. You'll find the person bleeding a lot. But this Sihr al Dam, cold in the limbs of the body, constant feeling tightness in the chest, numbness in his chest, tingling in the body, sudden changes in personality from hate to love. Lot of doubts, obsession, confusion in speech, speech, frequently fatigue and stubborn, not being able to settle in one place. Movement. You find the person 
every time he wants to do something. We ask Allah to protect us and make it easy for all, all of us. How to move forward from this black magic of blood which has been done either through menstrual or any another blood. The individual needs to have Quranic shower. He needs to get five liters of water, read the ayat, for example, talks about blood. There's so many ayat talks about blood in the Quran. If you want me to pick few ayat, I can pick... وَيَسَلُونَكَ عَنِ الْمَحِيدِ Surah Tabak, read that, repeat that verse seven times on the water, blow on it and read Falaq, Al-Nas, Atil Kursi, Qul Al-Kafirun and Surah Tabakra together and try and read at least minimum of four Jews a day inshallah of Quran if you can if you can note, if you don't know how to read try and read a lot of Atil Kursi in the water, take Sidr Put it in that water, shower with it frequently, sprinkle with it in your body. In the mix of that water for shower, you put salt, a little bit, few rocks of salt or few salt, few spoons of salt inside. That water, you make it for showering frequently and have another water for drinking frequently. Now, if you ate or drank, Try and flush your system frequently and ask Allah to make it easy for whoever is going through this difficulty, specifically to do with black magic of blood. It's one of the most serious magic and this is one of the branches of black magic. Ask Allah to make it easy for the believing men and women are there. If you have any question or you have you struggle with any ways or form, send me an email, inshallah. My email will be there, or you can just send me a text or call me, inshallah. I'll get back to you by the will of Allah. You just need to be patient, inshallah. Ask Allah to make it easy for the believing men and women out there who've got any sort of problem. Black magic of blood from the Ruqi talk Abu Yahya wa akhiru da'wana wa salamun ala al-mursaleen wa alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen. Ta yatabayyana lahum annahu al-haq.